Hey there my gorgeous friends on the internet, today is a special day, you know why it's a special day? Because I told you to send me all your projects, your games, your websites, your apps, your mom pictures. And you guys did, you guys sent me over 300 submissions uh, with different kind of cool things. Now unfortunately I cannot do all of them because that would mean 5 hour video. Uh, but hey let me know, maybe we can do a part 2 if you like this. Now to make this as fun as possible, I haven't looked through them at all because I want to make this kind of a reaction type. If, if I haven't looked through them, it is a reaction time. Oh my goodness, it should be a review otherwise. So I told my girlfriend to take a look at all of them and send me one by one right here for us to see and visualize on this 21 inch piece of display, a very bad display has a magenta color to it. It's a new feature. Okay, you ready? Let's take a look at the first one. I just refresh real quickly and we see a snowman going through the mountain. Wait a minute. Is this snowman Mr. Jesus? Oh my goodness. What is this magic? All right, so we have, can we scroll? We cannot scroll, but maybe we can click. Now, the first in instinct for me... Oh, it's another one! <laughs> Defying laws and physics. So the first instinct of me is to open the presents, but we learn from our mothers is that it's always better to give than to receive. She, she lied. She lied to me. So what we're gonna do is we are gonna click on the house. Now, nothing happens. Can we click on the trees? Can we click on the presents? Not even the presents. Well, anyway, so I'm guessing this guy made this full either in CSS or SVG. So let's find out. If this is full in CSS, I'm gonna be super impressed. Oh my goodness. Everything is in CSS. Let, let's take a look just to make sure that we don't have any images. And no, we don't. So this guy made the whole website in CSS. So that's very impressive. Uh, Namecar.github.io. Good job. You, you made what other people can never do, not even me. So I'm highly impressed. But why can I not open my presents? Fix that. Next one is by Kevin Nisai. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. You throw me some animations and you got me. There we go. Okay, that's pretty cool. Cookies, we don't want cookies. Okay, so this I like. This is a very original way you can create this nav kind of thing or whatever you have. Um, now, one thing I would do is whenever you go to the edge so that this doesn't jump like this because the, the reason why this is happening is that it, it loses that hover state. So it goes like disco, disco, disco. Uh, so you don't want to have that. So the way you can fix that is have a bigger parent div. And whenever you hover over that parent div, this one starts animating. But this is very cool. And we also got some background changing there and the lines animating. So that's probably with SVG. Very, very nicely made. Like it, very simple, just text, but it's very effective. Let's take a look if we click. So this also transitions with some animations. Uh, I'm not gonna say anything. You are very good. You know what you're doing, obviously. Next one is find, finding Kanye. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna have trouble with this one. Okay, Kanye, I listened to all your albums, Graduation, that's my favorite. So this should, this should be good. All right, start. Here it is. Oh, there we go. That's not too bad. 2.5 seconds. Finding calm. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Oh my goodness. I'm the Kanye master. There he is. I feel like if you just kind of generally, generally look over all the coffee beans, you can just do it very fast. All right. Garlic. Coca-Cola with garlic. You are absolutely insane, my friend. Okay, let's take a look though. So we have this nice color here, maybe a, a wave SVG animating here. That's cool. Can we scroll? We cannot. Yes, we made it. Okay, let's take a look what we have. Are these clickable? And you know why there are no nav links or anything? Because this website is a lie. It's not true. 
It's not true. I did not hit her. It's not true. I did not. <laughs> oh, hi, Mark. But can you send me one, please? Next up, we have a link on Netlify. And this is by Mr. Hey. Hey, folks, I'm a developer. All right, Jayesh Temekar. <laughs> okay, that's your name. All right, what you got here? Let's see, you have a portfolio, and the first thing that pops in my eyes is that you have a dark mode, so that's nice. Um, okay, so we have these images from Undraw, I know. Um, and then, let's take a look what we have here. Things I have designed for digital media agencies. All right, so let's hit next, see. I all right, so I see you have a heavy use of Undraw, which is fine. They're very nice, uh, but let's just take a look at one that is not. Can I click? Oh, we can also drag, so that's very nice. Uh, I wish I could see these, though, uh, if this would be like clickable. Um, or maybe you don't have them, they're just concept, then in that case, it's fine. Uh, like from what I see here, looking, they look pretty good. Uh, I like the, the, the way you use colors. Uh, because even here, as you can see, you have that yellow and you have this grayish bluish kind of thing. Uh, but it kind of works as well with the images. So you kind of mirror whatever you have in your image on your text, which I think is always very nice. Same as you can see here, he kind of changes up the color, uh, the colors, which is fine. You can just experiment with, with different colors, but he also changes it in the text. So as you can see, we have the, the pinkish color here and here as well. So good design skills. I really like it. Let's go down here. What experiences do you have? Angular, JavaScript, SAS, React. Good on you, my friend. Get Adobe XD and Team Player. Okay, so you're... <laughs> I'm a proficient in Team Player. The one thing I would say that you might consider changing, if you want, is to kind of get rid of this generic man here as the portfolio and just add maybe a signature or make your own logo. Other than that, good job. Next up, we have something from Vignes. Good Vignes, okay? Double Vignes, that's, that's good. You doubled your name, level up. Good on you. All right, so we have three dots here. Uh, it says choose your difficulty. So let's go green, I assume is easy, medium, and we have difficult. All right, let's go with, let's go difficult. So what am I doing? Three, two, one. Uh, okay, wait. Average reaction time, zero milliseconds. That what, that's what they told me in school. That's my average reaction time. I don't know what it means, but I, I, I got an F, a zero. You cannot even get a zero in school. I got the zero though. I went to do math. They told me to do an exercise. I was staying there with my crayon, with my crayon, with my charcoal, writing. Ed, what is 10 plus 10? You got a zero. Your reaction time was zero. And then I ate the charcoal. Mm. Okay, so I assume that we have to do, uh, we have to click on that green thing that we saw. And the, the uh, we just test our reaction time, how fast we can click on it. So let's give it a shot. Okay, boom, boom, oh. <laughs> let's go again. Okay, maximum. Let's go, boy. Here we go. You've never been so impressed in your life. All right, there we go, there we go. I'm touching all the greens, touching all the greens. All right, so, hmm. Okay, this is getting a bit easy and I choose the most difficult difficulty. All right, there we go. Okay, so you got a bit used to it, it gets a bit easy. So one thing I would say you could do is make them a bit speedier. So with time, they should speed up or just kind of make it so, you, like they fade in and they fade out fast and you have a certain amount of time that you can click on it and then multiple piles of the, these green boxes appear so you have to click multiple of those I think that would be a bit more fun so there we go 67 we were so close two more we needed next up we have a portfolio made right in space Oh, there we go. We have a loading screen. Hello. My name is Alex. I'm a front-end web developer 
perfect. So we have the sky, we have planet getting killed by the sun. And all right, we cannot scroll, we cannot do anything. At least we can grab the text. I do like the animation on the text. You have that glitch kind of effect. So let's click on the menu. Oh my goodness, what's happening? Okay, projects, we cannot click on it, but we can click on the barber. There we go. So this was basically me five years ago when I was a professional barber. My name was Dimitri Johnson. Uh, so I like that he added me in here. So thank you so much. Uh, and yeah, it just shows up basically the project. I'm not touching anything, it's moving on its own. What is this? It's sorcery. The witch, I'm leaving. I'm leaving this website. It's witchery is crazy. Okay, other than that, I do like it. I wish I could scroll through this uh, because uh, a lot of people just don't have patience. Okay, trust me on this one when I say people don't have patience uh, for you to just leave a PowerPoint on for them to watch. But other than that, it's pretty good. I like it. I do wish there would be more things here for me to click rather than because you're kind of a bit confused on what to do when you're on this website and you're like, uh, okay, never mind. I do have to click up here and I just wish this would be a bit more uh, visible for me to, to kind of visualize rather than having nothing and you're like, oh, well, I guess that's the website. Goodbye, everybody. Okay, next up we have is Insanely Elegant. Oh my goodness, take a look at that. So basically just a lot of very nice illustrations going on here. I do like the animation. Uh, we create powerful web apps. All right, can we scroll? So this is what happens when you scroll. You get this slide, but it also does it by itself in case you are lazy. And you also have the buttons here if you want to do it. So you have a lot of options. Okay, let's take a look. When we hit here, we have this nice little animation. Okay, so basically the text that you hover over gets filled up with juice, with white juice. And when we click on portfolio, let's just take a look at what we have. Okay, PHP we have. 5.7, the latest of the PHP technologies brought to you by none other than we transfer. Dropbox.com. Okay, so take a look at the projects. It's amazing. All right, blockchain. We have C to Lab, and we have Expenser. So it's an expense tracker. Okay, I'm not gonna spend too much time on this, but I do like the look and feel of your website. I think you have everything going for you. You know what you're doing, and I, I give it a. Five out of seven. We have the next one, which is called bread.cool. And it says, hey, do you want to use my, my microphone? So I'm not sure if it's gonna hijack my microphone, but let's give it a go. So I'm gonna say allow, say show commands to view commands, show commands, show commands. Oh, there we go, it's working. Uh, and we have some options here. Uh, let's try one. Pineapple. Pineapple are cool, I guess, but not really. Clear. All right, let's try another one. Uh, refresh page. Refresh me page. Refresh. Oh, it worked. Very cool. What is this alien technology you're using? Are you listening to me on the microphone right now, Mr. Bread.cool? Can you hear me? How are you doing? Very good projects. I, I love these. These are one of my favorites. Just having fun coming up with random uh, creative things. So that's a big yes for me, Mr. Bread.cool. I love it. Okay, launch the website. So it's an interactive game type website. Okay. Oh my goodness. Scroll down or press keyboard down. All right, let's go. Let's go, everybody. Level one. Oh my God, this is very cool. Beginner. All right. <laughs> All right, we get the Mario references going on there. Yes. Oh, they're coming for me. The buildings. This, I feel like this happens to me 
too often. The, the buildings are attacking me. Can we go through the buildings? Leave me alone, buildings! Alright, let's score the hoop. Alright, can I get the ball? Leave me alone, block boy! Okay. Now, to be honest, my swimming skills are not that great. Uh, but we're gonna try. But if you have, if you're not gonna see any new videos from me, uh, it's because of this. So let's. Oh my goodness, we have the fishies. We have the jQuery, CSS, JavaScript, the crabs. <laughs> I'm not gonna make a joke about that one. Okay, and then we have the turtles, and then we have. Oh, what happened there? I just, I just levitated out of the water. Okay. Incognito digital animation 70% code 15% graphic 50% lock 20% skill 10% power and will okay let's keep moving let's keep moving okay very cool very cool I do love this ooh now we're flying that's one of my other phobias Let's keep going, let's keep going, and we can send a message. Very cool, good job. Very cool. This is, again, another very creative thing you can do, just kind of make a game out of a website, uh, and it's absolutely mind-blowing. Now, if I already know your website and I want to send you a contact email, I would hate this. <laughs> Next up, we have Mr. James Welbs. All right, adding a quote to a landing page is stupid. Thank you for visiting James Welps. Oh, uh, load it up, everybody. Looks okay. Next up, we have a website called lunar.curahq. Let's take a look. How dare you? How dare you? So there we go, everybody. Thank you so much for watching this episode. And let me know if you want to see a part two, because these are kind of fun. I'm not going to lie. So if you have any projects, websites, games, whatever you want, whatever you want, send me a meme. I'm, I'll review the meme, okay? Let's do that. Then, then just let me know and we can do another part. And until next time, I will see you in the jungle. Next to the lions. Arr. Bitch.